All right, good morning. We have driven about an hour from our home this morning. We stopped and had breakfast at a, one of our favorite spots in Conway. The and big girl breakfast. The big girl <laughs> breakfast. And then we have um, stopped at a place my wife has wanted to see for the last 30 years. One of those things that are on the side of the road that everybody has in the state that they live in that they don't necessarily take the time to stop and visit. I always was curious about a natural bridge. What is a natural bridge? So now I'm finally getting a chance to see it. Today's her day. <laughs> Let's go. If you can name five things on this wall, drop them in the comments below. There it is, the big reveal. I can't get the short wife and the tall bridge and the frame at once. So, I'm gonna, there we go. There it is, the natural bridge. And apparently at some point it was used as a logging road or bridge across when they logged the timber out of this area. Okay, we've made it to the top of the natural bridge. It wasn't very far of a walk. But this apparently is what they used as a bridge when they were logging the timber out of this little holla, holler, as we say here in Arkansas. Um, and we were having a debate on whether or not you would go across that with a wagon full of timber or horses dragging logs. Maybe it was in better shape back when they were 100 years ago when they were logging the timber out of here, but not too sure we would put a whole bunch of weight on there and go across with it. Well, never mind that, the women that were having a picnic on it in that picture. Oh yeah, I probably would picnic on it. I don't think I would haul logs across it. Okay, we have finished seeing the natural bridge. A uh, few, few things about the area. So it's $5 per person to get in. Um, that goes to maintain the grounds, which the trail is very easy. You could walk it in tennis shoes. I'm walking in um, Chacos. You could walk in flip-flops. It's very, very well maintained, even uh, has steps. and Nice stone steps. Yeah, nice stone steps. Um, Five dollars to get in per person. The lady at the front was very knowledgeable about the area and what kind of went on uh, here on the grounds. And there is a men's and women's bathroom in the parking lot before you come in. It is end of June here in Arkansas, and it's been in the 90s to 100s for the last week, and we're here, it's probably about nine or 10. And it's 90 degrees right now. Yeah, 90 degrees, Very, but it's very shaded, so um, even as hot as it is, of course, I'm sweating, but I'm fat. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm glistening. But it's still comfortable. It's a comfortable, it's only like three quarters of a mile. Well, it's not a very long trail, but there's a lot to see in a pretty short distance. And some interesting stuff in the old cabin. And we stopped right here in this little cave because it's about 10 degrees cooler than it is everywhere else on the little trail. Well, a few quick things before we go. We did recently book a trip back to Italy. So we're headed to Bologna in October. Um, so if you want to, and we plan to do video uh, there, part of this little trip today was so I can um, get back in the groove of shooting video and, and taking pictures and stuff. So if you want to see videos from there, we'll be posting them on this YouTube channel. You can do the normal stuff, like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, all the good things. Mm -hmm.